Hey guys, what's up? Welcome. Today is a full body pump workout. We're gonna be pumping up those arms, the legs, the glutes, the core by utilizing the rhythm of the music and tempo change. Hey, if you're new to this channel, welcome. Do make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you do not miss any workouts. We're gonna be warming up with weights. I'm gonna use 12 pounds. So just honor your body. What does it need today? Roll the shoulders back. We're gonna start with a slow deadlift. Take it down for four, three, two. Rise it up with a flat back. All right, same thing, a little faster. Two by two here. I always say it's like you're shaving your legs. Hey, summer's around the corner. You better shave them now, right? Keep your belly in, shoulders back, spine is long. Down three, up one. Now remember, this is a warm up. You pick a weight that just feels like kind of medium. Pull the belly up and in. One more. You're gonna go down one in row one. So come in for the brakes on. Now pull it in. Rise up. In a dead row, we wanna have a flat back and then pull the weights towards the waist. I like my hands coming to the hips. Slow, clean it up. So pull to the chest, press. Back down to the chest, release. Do it again, pull it up, press. Back to the shoulders, release to the thighs. Upright row two, quick. One, clean and press. Upright row. Clean and press. In your upright row, elbows lead. Do it again. Keep it tight to the body. Clean press. One more, and then the weight is gonna stay for squats. Up at the shoulders. Hold here, down two, up two. Now, you have an option. You wanna drop, and you can curl. You like that? So you warm up the arms, or maybe you have a barbell today. You can do that, right? Down three, up one. I'm gonna keep my weight up here. But you have that option. Sit back into your heels. Two more. All right, step out, pause to the right, squat. In to the left side, step in, pause, squat. Do it again. One more, please. All right, hit the single squats. Bring it in. To drop and pull. Even this is a great option. A little swing in the curl. All right, so we got those feet a little bit outside those hips. Same movement, but bring the feet in to narrow. And again, you can swing or not. You're gonna see this in the squat track. These narrow squats. All right, bring the weight up, press to the sky. Push. So there are two tracks that we are not gonna do today. It is chest and shoulders, so work them right now. Release the weight, dead row. Coming up, dead row again. Clean press, pull it up, slow. Push, bring it down, release. Do it again, pull it up. Push. Two upright rows, here we go. Clean and press, this is kinda like a shoulder track, right? Yeah, do it again. So you got your shoulders. Clean and press. Two more rounds. Come on, pull it up. Keep your core tight. All right, we're gonna do some dead rows. Come down and pull for three now. Pull tight. Pinch between the shoulder blades. Can you rise up? Do it again. Of course you can. All right, one more. And we are tall. Roll the shoulders. All right, we're getting ready for squats. 
I'm gonna be grabbing my 15s. If you're feeling strong, you can go heavier. So it's up to you. What do you got? Woo, you guys ready? Right, set the feet. Start slow, four by four. Drop here, four, three, two, rise it up. Now, we're gonna go really slow, you ready? Eight counts, drop it slow. Eight, seven. Oh, this is slow, right? Now press it up again, eight counts. Press through the heels, feel what's happening to your body. We're done with that. Two by two. Nice and smooth here. Oh, we are so happy today. It is feeling beautiful out here, right? Woo! Now, drop hold four counts. Halfway hold. Oh yeah. Do it again. So when you hear this, this is what we're gonna be doing. Halfway hold. Push out that booty. Down hold again, four counts. Four count rise up. Take it wide, feet face forward, squat singles. Yeah, now, a squat, toes face forward, not sumos. Then we turn the feet out. You have options, right? You can drop that weight. It could be a goblet squat. Eight more. And then as you get warmer, you get deeper in that squat. So this is your wide. Two more, then we take it narrow. Tighten it up, right now. Yeah, feel the difference. I'm actually gonna drop my weights down. Pull the shoulders back. You want more intensity? How about we pulse? Woo! Or you can keep it those big ones. I'm gonna give you that option. Squeeze something. All right, relax, set, slow, go, eight. Oh yeah, round two. You feel the difference? Press it up. <laughs> Woo. Slow and controlled. That was tough, right? Two by two. We melt. Remember now, I like my weight up in some of these squats. Allows me to deepen it. Ready? Here we go. Drop hold. Halfway. Drop hold. Watch that low back. If you feel it too much, come up a little bit more. Halfway. Knees track your toes. One more. Four count to the top. Keep it wide. Here we go. Drop. I want a nice power to the top. I hold my breath when I drop and I exhale the top. Two more, narrow it out. Tighten it up. It's good to close those legs sometimes, right? Woo! Use a little inner thigh. You can stay with this. I'm gonna pulse, how about you? Keep it tight in those thighs. Come on, press in a little, a little bit. All right, take it out again. Woo! Down two, up two. Good. Woo. You doing okay though, everybody? Step out, right pause, three squats. Three. Take it in. Left pause and drop. Three. All right, reset. Wide. Ready? You guys ready? Last set. Wide. Drop. Hold, hold. Halfway up. Oh, I don't want to miss these, right? Drop hold. You can bring it in a little bit here. In the heels. 
Halfway up. Come on, eyes up. Do it again, last one. Four counts to the top. Wide. Singles. Yeah, go for it, Tier. Last round of these. What can you do to drive up the intensity for you? Maybe you come up halfway and then a full range. I'm gonna go narrow. I'm gonna pulse the whole time. Bring it in, come on. And it's 32. Woo! You probably did over 150 squats. What do you think about that? Oh yeah. Come on, 16 more. Toes back, eyes up. Bang it out. But watch your body. Guys, get rid of the weight. Four, three, two, you're done. Woo! All right, we need a stretch. What I'm gonna have you do, you can do a little forward fold, stretch out your low back. You can do a quad stretch if you need to. Take a deep breath. Good job, but you guys are doing good at home. Oh, Ooh. oh my gosh, sunshine, feels so good. From that, because our back is feeling a little bit tight, hey, triceps. Oh my God, this is so much fun, five moves. Dolphin push-ups, we've got skull crushers, tricep press, kickbacks, and overhead extensions. Holy moly, that's the last stuff. So get yourself into a down dog position, ready for dolphin push-ups. A dolphin push-up, we have the hands wide. We bring the elbows, we're moving that too wide within the frame of the body, and we take it down slow. Elbows come down to the ground. Let's go. Four, three, two, press it up for four. Two by two, you can always drop to the knees, but lean a little bit into the hands. Two more. Get your hips up if you want that more challenge. Singles, pull the belly in. Four. And you can do some uh -huh on here. Two by two. Single again. All right, grab your weights, skull crushers, in eight, seven. You gotta hustle for this muscle here. It's a two by two, arms are up. Skull crusher, two by two, down. Press it up. Now, in a skull crusher, you can have those feet grounded and the abs pulling in. Do it again, two by two. One and three, quick drop. Work that body. Slow to the top. Two more. And then we're going to hit the singles, you guys. Because you're going to turn it up. Single, 16. Hey, watch those arms. They stay inside the frame of your body. Brace your core to move. Eight more. And then we keep this weight. And we drop it towards the belly and we push it up over the shoulders. It's gonna be a repeat of the same sequence we did. Ready, two by two, drop it down towards the waist, keep it in, push it up. A little angled, right, knuckles up. Two more. One, three, quick drop, slow. Look at your wrist. It's straight, right? You know what's happening after this? Anybody? Singles, go! You get a little chest, hey, because we didn't do the chest press today, right? So you get a little bit here. Especially with those triceps when it's narrow. All right, let's go. Eight. And then we go into kickbacks on a knee, or you can stand up. 
Rock yourself up. I'm gonna go for my eights. No, I got fives, I don't have eights. <laughs> Woo! So really drop that stomach over your leg. Elbows up by your ribs. Here we go, two by two, let's go. Now, when you get that chest really low, you're gonna get more in the tricep. I'm actually glad I got fives. Four more of these. And again, you can be upright if that feels better for your body. Two more. And then we hit singles and it's 14 singles, yeah. Go. Try not to bring that fist to your shoulders. Stop at your hips. You got four more and then it's overhead extension. We stand up or you can kneel. I'm gonna kneel. One more. All right, get ready. In four, arms are up. Overhead, two by two. Bend. Again, elbows go out a little bit and then they come right into the side of that face. You ready? Single, 16, this is it. Oh my gosh, I think we hit every angle of that tricep, right? So I went to tens after I had those fives. Ooh, I'm pushing it, how about you? Two more. Release. Woo, nice job. Give yourself a little pat on the back and give it a great tricep stretch here. Hey, from that back of the arm, we're gonna go to the front of the arm and I'm gonna be using my 12s. Shake it out. Bicep curls, palms are up, shoulders are back. Brace that core, take it up slow, four counts. You're gonna see a little row curl today. All right, hit the singles, big kick, stand back. So again, I'm the whip eights. This is a tough one, I'm gonna tell you right now. We're gonna really pump up those biceps. Two more. Two by two, slow it down. Now, in a bicep curl, to get more out of this, I want you to really squeeze at the top. And you control the down movement here. Four more of these. Now you keep moving. I'm gonna show you what that row curl looks like. We come down, we're gonna do some slow, and then I'm gonna bring it in, looks like a preacher's curl, and then I'm gonna rise back up. Step the feet in, try it with me slow. Come down, curl, release, and coming up. So it's a little bit of a deadlift feeling, and then we curl. All right, you guys, now you know, faster, down curl. Rise up now. Try not to use momentum. So keep your back flat, your knees a little soft. One more. Give me three now. Stay here. Three. Shake it up. All right, so this is two of the four sets of the threes. Just get all those numbers. Start to feel it now, right? All right, we're at the bottom of this first round. All right, step back one foot, two by two. If it starts to get hard and you don't want to change your weight, maybe you do hammer curls. That's a little bit easier. Even that variety is good, so you can always change that. I don't know about you, you guys, but oh, that sun feels so good. Woo! All right, we're gonna step it in, do a slow row curl. Oh yeah. Sometimes when we slow it down, we feel something a little bit more, right? A little faster. 
when you're at that bottom place. So you want hard, keep the palms up. All right, you know it. Come three. One of four. Let's go. Ooh, they're pumping now. All right, in this track, there is no break. Come on up, step back, two by two. Here we go, two by two. Woo, but guess what? We are in the home stretch. Row curl, slow. Oh, this is where I feel it a lot, right? Woo. All right, one more slow. Crank it. Bring it. All right, we got six now. Triples, go. So we did fours. Now we're doing six rounds here. Woo, rise up. You can do it, come on. Yeah, easy to stop when we get a little uncomfortable. We want to get a little bit more than that. Friend, you got two more rounds. Go. Rock into the heels of your feet. Not your toes. Come on. Woo. Rise up. Oh. Put it down. Lengthen out those arms into a T. Thumbs can be down. Thumbs can be up. Give it a stretch. Woo. We're moving into legs. I'm gonna be using 15 pound weights in the leg track here. Roll the shoulders back, my weight is gonna be at the top. I'm gonna step back with the right foot, step forward, step back, forward, go. For four. Or you can stay, if you don't wanna move, step in, switch. Four more. Do it again. Warm it up. Now, you have options where you want your weight. Switch it. Keep this leg back. Down three, up one. Three, two, one. Push away. We can turn a little bit here so you can see that posture. So think from the crown of the head down into your tailbone. You're nice and strong and long. Two by two. Down, two, press away. Watch how much you push into the toe. Try to push into the heel. Oh. Bottom, actually top half, singles, drop and push. All right, so we don't want to do this forever. So we just try to minimize the movement, maximize the effort. Same thing, bottom, low, stay there. You can always bring the back foot in a little bit more at any point. All right, we're done with a small. Give me full range here. Drop and push. You have options too. You can move the back foot. Okay, so now we're big. Now we're gonna pulse, double time, let's go. Push, I might change my weights. Bring the back foot in a little bit. Woo, come on. Eyes up, eight. Then you have a little break. Let me go to the other leg. Breathe. Nice job. Woo. Feel okay though? Everybody's good? Weight can rack up. You're in that lunge position. Three, one. All right, how about that posture? You can always just be a little bit better. Two by two. When we load at the top, great for bone density of the spine. Tight 
hop half, small and controlled. Really focus in the heel. Hold the shoulders back. Same movement, bottom. Just too much in the knees, you can stay more top half, right? Full range, go. And when you come back to the workout, you can change things up. You can even put your foot up on a bench. Yeah, that would be tough, right? Ready to pulse it? Get low, double time. Really in the heel. Lunges, get more backside. Whew, you all right, Carol? Oh yeah, I feel ya. All right, no, wait. Unless you wanna hold on to something. Yeah, watch the move. We're gonna step to the front, knee drive, and then switch legs. You can go to the back. You guys ready? Lunge front, knee up. Switch it. So you can hold a plate weight. Or a dumbbell. A great chance to get the heart rate up. Four more. Come on. Just lunges. Singles. Come on. Woo! And you can get to the crown without sacrificing your spine. Go for it. Lunge, stop and pulse for four. Push away. Three, two, come back. Switch it. Four. Come back, alternate. Go. This is it. Big step. When we do these moving lunges, you get a lot more, more quad engages. Last one. Nice job. Woo. All right, you guys need a high five on that one. That one was an awesome one. You too. Woo. This back track is going to have dead rows in the presses. I'm going to grab 15s and then I'm going to use my fives at the end. Dead row, two by two. Slow, pull it in. Release it down. Coming up. Single this out, dead rows. So I'm using my 15, because it's a big load, because we got a lot of muscles working here in dead rows and in clean and presses. One more. All right, slow, clean it up. Push. Yeah, get off your chest. Now, down and row, slow. Push your butt back. Pull that bar in. Dead lift, two by two. And again, it, hold on, we gotta start at the top. I, gotta, <laughs> I can't have that in there. Sorry. Are you ready? At least we weren't that far into it. Here we go. Backtrack, we got dead rows, clean presses, and a little reverse fly with light weights. Roll the shoulders back, are we ready? Two by two, dead left. Dead row, pull it in. Release. Rise it up. Faster. Dead rows. Remember, in the row, pull the elbows up, brace the core. Slow, clean it up. Press. Dead row to the knees. Pull to the belly. Release. Rise it up. Dead lift. Two by two. All right, keep it tight to the body, right? Push the hips back. And I push them a little bit forward as I rise up. Four more. A little bend in the knees. You could even do straight legs if that's okay for you. You have to have amazing posture. 
slow clean pressing here we go he's off that chest right dead row slow you know what happens after slow yeah go quick dead row one more All right, you guys, same thing, but let's do a triple at the top and at the bottom. Hold here for three. Down row. Deadlift, two by two, round two. All right, that was it. We just do it again. And then we go to the knees and do a little reverse fly. So that we're gonna lighten that load soon. Four more. And I want you to brace the core. When I say pull it in, it's like, huh, like you cough really hard. Slow clean and press. Dead row. Your body, please. Give me those triples. Bring it up. Come on up. All right, waist go down. I'm lightening my load to five. You may want three for your first time here. We got one knee down. I got threes here. You can grab those. So drop your chest and turn your pinky out and your thumb down. Two by two. Reverse block. Ooh, good intentions here. Now, you're going to be seeing a move that we did in one of the workouts about a week or two ago. But keep this going here. Try to get it up to shoulder height. Hey, who's pausing up there? Pinch and release. One more. Now we come on up the same thing. And then we spin, spin the hands up. Hands up, come forward. Bring it out again. And release. Woo! Do it again. T, spin into Y. Back to the T. Ready for tempo? Crank it up. Yeah, get it off that chest, right? If your range is not good, no weight. One more. All right, release, relax. Whew. Now, you make a decision if you want to change, but grab the weights. Are you ready? Round two. Two and two. This feels so good in that upper back, right? Yeah, it does. That's what you're thinking, right? It's so good for you. You should be blessed that your body can do this. See, I got you on your knees. You're begging me, please. Come on. You ready for it? Bring it up. Pinkies in. Woo, reach it out. Hey, what do you feel there? I feel that under armpit area right there. Crank it up, go. You got three more. Woo, come on. Oh, that's all I could do, how about you? Oh, that's all I could do. <laughs> like, oh my God, my arms. Oh, great job. This pump workout has a lot of arms, right? Are you feeling it? Feeling in the arms? Now we're gonna go to the core. We're gonna use a, I'm gonna use a 12 pound dumbbell. If you want a 10, I would suggest at least eight or higher. And we're gonna start with a roll up and then we're gonna twist where we drop the weight to one side. We're gonna drop the weight to the front and the knees to the back. So we got a roll up, four by four. Let's go. 
reach to the top and then sink and tuck to roll down a little faster, two by two. One more, legs come up, knees drop to the back, weight drops to the front, right here, two by two, down, pull it up. We have a total of 10. Only go as low as your body wants to go. Keep the head on that mat. Pull up and in the waist. Tuck in, reach away. We got eight. Take your time. You can try to do a little pull those hips in more. You can even keep the head down the whole time. We go right back to the twist, bring it up, drop weight front. Inhale to lower, exhale, bring it back to that center. Into that ball, reach away. Take your time. I want you to kind of come in, pause, and then take it back. Loving this. How about you? All right, rock yourself up. I'm gonna face the garage. We got a Superman. We got a super. Come on down here. Now lift up into up dog. Give it a moment. Stretch. Four, three, two. Release down. We got a super with a snow angel. Watch your equipment here. Reach up to super. Sweep back over the legs. Reach forward. Release. Up and open. Down. Keep it going. Come on. Up. Reach. Two more. We're going to come into elbow plank. Come on up and hold. Hold. Brace the core. We're going to be doing a walking plank. Come up to the hands. Come down to the elbows. Right knee tap. Left knee tap. Walk it up. Bring it down. Knee drop right left. Walk it up. Knee drops. Now walk it up on the left. Balance it out. Come on down. Back knee, front knee. Two more. Look out in front. Hold that core tight. Take it up. Knee drop. All right, you guys, we're gonna hold. Four on plank. Now if you want more challenge, reach the hands, straighten them out. But they're extended out. That's extended plank. That's harder. Woo! Tuck your tailbone a little bit here. My arms are a little shaky. How about yours? Oh. Nice job. Woo! It was short and sweet, but man, did you work hard today. Push back into your heels. Flip it around. And you're going to give me figure four stretch.
Do it again, reach it up. Grab the other wrist, bring it over. Push your hips a little bit forward. Quad stretch, right leg, pull back. One more time, have that gratitude, pull it into your heart, hold it there for a moment, Ooh. and you my friend, you did awesome, great job you, great job to my crew, I always got to make sure I thank them, I think the last few times I did not say thank you to you guys, because these guys are amazing, I love seeing them here, I love being a part of the community, don't you, so make sure you are following me on Instagram, Facebook, I am there, share this with a friend, comment below, and guess what, thumb it up, right friends, thumb it up, it all helps this channel grow, you guys have an awesome day, and we'll see you back on this mat, take care, great job ladies, that went flowing, good, all right, now we got a jump.